Come now, Alice. It's only a dream. It's not a dream. It's a memory. And it makes me sick. Now, focus. Wait. You're floating again. Weightless. A cipher. Relax. I'm in hell. Forget it. Abandon that memory. It's unproductive. Go to Wonderland. Forget it. Go to Wonderland. I'd rather not, Doctor. My Wonderland's shattered. It's dead to me. Your preference doesn't signify, girl. Now, Alice, where are you? I'm sailing with a friend. Hmm. It's different somehow. Things have changed. Change is good. It's the first link in the chain of forgetting. What's happening? Are you mad? I'm not mad. Rabbit. That's not right. What are you doing? Is something wrong? Something wrong? Bravo! No! Not that! Don't struggle, Alice. Let them move to one exploded and there's a steam hammer in my chest. Yes, well, the cost of forgetting is high. My memories make me vomit. What can I... Remember other things. I want to forget. Who would choose to be alone, imprisoned by their broken memories? I'll set you free, Alice. Memory is a curse more often than a blessing. So you've said many times, and... And I will say again, the past must be paid for. Now... Before our next session, collect those pills from our high street chemist. Very well, Doctor. It's my turn to forget, Alice. Now, Charlie, your pa was hung for killing your ma who beat you. Let's forget that, shall we? The past is dead, Charlie. in your room? What's wrong there? Can't find the door. Ollie Pitch and Smalls. Where bloomers? Deserve my bitter tears. Want some? no idea how humble a home could be. If not for my drawings and the photographs, this could pass for my room at the asylum. Doctor's pet. Too good for the asylum. Mad as a hatter without the charm. Killed her family. Who'd want her? Another day, a different dream, perhaps. Oh, this 
thing is killing me back. I call work liable, bastards. She ever work? Where's her plan? Too good for company? She don't get close. Hates being touched. Who likes it then? Never snap. Afraid? Following furry creatures into dark holes has become a habit. I hope it's not a vice. Stars and garters, Alice Little. Slumming again, are we? Nurse Witless. What luck. Twice in as many months. Out on your own? You look frazzled, dearie. Not doing well? Not really. Come along home then and look at my pigeons. Pretty birds. Like you. I don't think so. Our last visit cost me several pounds and got me nowhere. I might recall where your mangy rabbit got to. Still a mess. No surprise. Her kin roasted like chestnuts right before her eyes. Ten years in Rutledge Asylum wasted everyone's time. Dr. Bumby won't do better. Still hauling out her questions. The fire, her memory. I deserve consideration, don't I? Who found her her new clothes? Who got her a place at Bombay's? Where'd she be without me? On the street, selling her backside. Ooh, like some <laughs> pigeons, though. She's doled out the old pound or two. But what I know is worth more than that. Kept her secret, haven't I? Heard her say, Oh, died on my account. I couldn't save you. I've told her my silence is for sale. Keep. I'm a good sort, really. Not like her nanny, that uppity whore. Or that lawyer fellow Radcliffe took her stupid rabbit. Need money. Warned her I'd tell the coppers if she didn't make a donation to my upkeep. She yells and goes off her head. Does she can't remember her name? What I heard. Witness, do you mean to harm me? To send me back to the asylum? I won't say no. I've a first you could photograph. Need a drink? Good man, send me to what?
very upsetting journey. But I'm rid of Pris, or whatever she's become. At least the place I've landed is somewhat familiar. About time too, Alice. Blasted cat. Don't try to bully me. I'm very much on edge. Perfect. When you're not on edge, you're taking up too much space. You're no help at all. But you know I can be. I'll frighten myself. When necessary, thanks very much. I was hoping to escape from all that. Abandon that hope. A new law reigns in this wonderland, Alice. It's very rough justice all round. We're at risk here. You be on your guard. Again, Alice, I'll expire. You're two times too reckless, my girl. Muscaria Alice is merely a stinky toadstool, a spongy consistency, but poisonous. I've been down this road before. Good things in small packages? Though lacking a bathing costume, a plunge in that pool is in order. My god, I'm shrinking in this potion. Sh shall I disappear? Almost. But the upside is that while smaller, you can see things that are nearly invisible to your bigger self. Ah, oh, I get it. Right. Forests for the trees, just the other way round. Short sighted is more than a matter of perspective. Look how small she's become, all curled up. She's barely there. A vixen in her hidey hole. Big slide in Hyde Park. Papa will take you soon, Alice. Thank <laughs> you. 
The Vorpal Blade is swift and keen, and always ready for service. I've not come back here looking for a fight. Really? That's a pity. One's certainly looking for you. Flight or fight implies a permanent choice, but flight often just means putting off the fight to another day. Choose your battles wisely, Alice. is simple and immutable. Human purpose is fickle because it is a slave to memory. Memories must be strictly managed, Alice. Unproductive ones must be eliminated. Again, Alice, you may approach. Why would I do that? You want to eat me? Yes, well, you taught me manners, and I've lost my taste for mad women. Strictly a poor sign diet for me. Everything's better with bacon, don't you agree? Of course you do. Now, there are pig snouts scattered about. I heard a few behind the house. Go fetch them for me. But take care for the pests that block your way. Pepper them up if they do. They need spice, and you're just the dick. A girl. To season them for me. You'll find that grinder serviceable. Why not season your own pick parts? Matter of priorities. My alabaster skin needs protection from the disgusting creatures running amok amidst the environs. But one gets peckish. Look, all you have to do is listen for the oink, then shoot the snout. You may like the results. I certainly will.
Thank you so much for the snout. Now go away. Finish your suit, girls. Bovine juveniles save their own.
malfunctions, this disaster is either his doing or his epitaph.
could have happened that way, Alice. You remember poor Mr. Crow? Died, didn't he? Dr. Wilson rejects spontaneous combustion, but I trust Mr. Dickens. Domain, almost as I remember it. Appearances, as you know better than most, can be deceiving, Alice. Much has changed since your last visit. Dr. Bumby says change is constructive, that different is good. Different denotes neither bad nor good, but it certainly means not the same. Find the Hatter, Alice. He knows more about different than you. But does he know more about the difference between bad and good? Making friends, Alice. You're as randomly lethal and entirely confused as you ever were. I've managed without you so far, Cat. Return to whatever hovels home to you. I'll call if I need you. Predictably rare. It's not a question of if, Alice. It's when. Now hold on, and as they say, shut up. So typical. made more graceful entrances. I suppose I must be grateful nothing's broken.
heart is open, Alice. Never closed. Never locked. It needs no key.
He's obsessed with time. Find him, or your own time may be short. We're all roast in our beds, Alice, for the sake of your father's unnatural devotion to printed paper. This horde of flambles wants only a malignant spark and poof, our flesh and blood is smoke and ash. lovely library was a fire trap. A conflagration waiting to happen.
Night. Hatta, I recall leaving you in a decrepit condition. What? what? Not in pieces. Uh, it's you. What's happened here? You've lost your hat, and some parts are missing. Missing indeed, though things being what they are. I barely missed their missing. As to what's happened, you should know that better than I. It's your place after all. I know my place. When did you ever know your place, or how to keep it? Now what's going on? going on, and round and up and down, and in my ears, and through my eyes, not my nostrils, down my gullet, and whining in my guts. Papa was exceedingly fond of trains. I don't like them much. You won't like this one at all. Nothing like when Mock Turtle was in charge of the looking last line. This railroad's a bloody shambles. The stink is ferocious, light, blinding, the noise, hellacious... Ah, oh, wait, Tata. I get the idea. A bad train. The world is upside down, Alice. Inmates run the asylum. No, thanks. And worst of all, I've left tealess. Tragic. If I do help, will you help me in return? Cross my heart, if I had one. Find my limbs and toss them into the chute. Machines will do the rest. Be on your way now, that's a good girl. <laughs> Best way out is through the crock face.
Yes, laid on, Alice. We'll go to Brighton on what we save on beeswax, candles, and oil.
first vent, then the next, and ride the currents up.
presence here is unwelcome. We have a mission to complete, and you are an intolerable annoyance. Some like it hot, but no one likes it this hot. <laughs>
gas laid on, Alice, will go to brighten what we save on beeswax candles and oil.
steady now. Gather your nerve. Jump to the first vent, then the next, and ride the currents up.
presence here is unwelcome. We have a mission to complete, and you are an intolerable annoyance. Some like it hot, but no one likes it this hot. <laughs>
Officer, a cat has nine lives, Alice. I hope you have it.
temporary setback, a minor hindrance, a trivial impediment. <laughs> I'll just move along. I'll deal with you later, Alice. You'll never stop our grand plan. <laughs> Mobility will make a nice change. Expect no thanks until I'm completely reconstructed. No resting on laurels, chiffoniers, chaise lounges, ming folding chairs, uh, stools. <laughs> 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 Years now, Alice. Time to put away childish things. of this desolate tract are unknown to all but the inhabitants. Oh, 
history thrives on suffering, obsolescence, and ruination. It's made the East End into a privy. Consider us simple farm We might liquidate what remains of your inheritance.
some insects eat their young, and they have much to teach us, alive or dead. and the canary goes to sleep, Alice. Act like a snuffed candle. Sleeps the sleep of the just. Like Mama and Baba. After ten, they're unconscious. Your dogged persistence will be rewarded with pain! I told you to cease and desist. But my warning goes unheeded, so without regret, you're about to feel like a lobster who's been tossed into the boiling pot!
dare stop! Keep running! You help me out! Ow! Damn! Finish my work and you're complete, Tata. Now, what about this damnable train? I feel like a new man, or whatever I am. I feel like an unsprung spring, like an uncorroded gear, like an untarnished bit of metal that sticks in your eye! Answer me, Hatter. I'm suffering. And changes here are a cause, or they're a reflection, or the effect. What's going on? What are the new rules? The law is just, just a whisper away, away home to wonder, wonder who, who knows how to measure rules with a ruler.
cruel rules. <laughs> Idiot. I should have left you in bits. Come. The least you can do is help me discover what's going on. severely impaired.
Are those two quaking? What are they up to? You'll never stop us, silly Hatter and Alice. It's left! You're too the late! The insolence, the arrogance, <laughs> the execrable table manners! They are destroyers of Wonderland! Defilers, denuders, derangers! Delightful! It's better! Did they actually create that infernal train to destroy Wonderland? What does that matter? They deserve to die! Ah! Put me down! Down this instant, I have to Enough talk! Battle time, Missy! Caught me very own ribbon then. Saints be praised that he works in mysterious ways and got plans for her. Take her over to the Mangle Mermaid. Rent a bed. Answer woo a girl, Mr. Brawl. Do you think you're doing? What comes natural like? Not natural to me. Get away. Reminds me of my snowdrop. Nanny knew her.
Tart with some rough edges. Likes everything rough, I'll wager. A handsome offer, but I've got an appointment with another man. Well, girl, how hard do you want to make this? You should know that doctor says I have a terrible disease. Uh, uh, you... Where's me money, you fucking spank bucket? Get those fat assed whores out on the street or I'll come up and brain Start you. Shut off, you cocker snipe. You'll never get past long Tim. I'll get what you and your flusies owe me, Miss Ladybird. See if I don't. Maybe you noticed I'm not pissing me drawers at the prospect. Alice Little, you'll make a nice change. Bring your disheveled self up here. Which one? The big one. One in the back, you fool. Back off, he's getting murdered. Free Bob, then. You won't give me what I want? I'll burn this dump of yours down to the ground. Go away. She's done no harm. <laughs> she hurt me feelings. Sleep, 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 sleep